Solid Edge ST8 presents intuitive tools that allow you to focus more on your design and less on the software. This latest version delivers the ability to create irregularly shaped patterns driven by a spreadsheet. In this demonstration, we'll complete the design of two controller arrays on this recovery robot's remote control module. First, we'll expose the joystick controls themselves. Note the joysticks are positioned by dimensions relative to the base coordinate system. We'll use these X and Y values to populate a new spreadsheet, also entering an angle value to ensure proper keyway orientation. Once the spreadsheet is complete, we'll save it. Now we'll display the entire remote control and use this spreadsheet to define a pattern of joystick cutouts in the front cover. An ST8 pattern by table defines an array of model features positioned and oriented with respect to a predefined coordinate system. In this case, the joysticks are dimensioned from the base coordinate system. Watch as we pattern the first hole using the coordinate system and our new spreadsheet file, simple and fast. Note that the right side keyway is rotated by corresponding angle values. Next, we need cutouts in the cover to accommodate soft touch buttons. We'll display the existing button pad part that has an array of additional buttons also driven by a spreadsheet. We'll use this same spreadsheet to define the pattern of cutouts. We repeat the general patterning process for the single button cutout, but we'll choose the existing button location spreadsheet to drive it. Note that in this case we'll position the other instances with respect to the first instance's centroid. As we finish the pattern command, you can see that our cutouts now match the pattern in the button pad. Since the spreadsheet drives this pattern, changes made in the table drive geometry. By removing related rows in the spreadsheet, we can delete the two middle rows of buttons. Once the spreadsheet is saved, Solid Edge dynamically updates the pattern in the model. We can quickly make more changes in instance location and orientation by changing the values in the columns. Adding a new cutout directly in the center of the pattern is as easy as adding a row in the spreadsheet. And because the same spreadsheet that drives the cutouts also defines the button array, Solid Edge automatically triggers the change to the button pad part. As you've seen in these examples, Solid Edge ST8 leverages a simple spreadsheet to create irregular and highly editable patterns of geometry, helping you to design faster and more intelligently without constraints. Solid Edge. Design better.